Hi everyone, it's Adam here from Web Starts, and I'm going to show you a new pretty cool little automation web application today called If This Then That, or IFTTT for short. So the first thing that you'll need to do is go to IFTTT.com, sign up and create yourself an account if you haven't already done so. Now if you do have an account, go ahead and log in and you will be looking at your IFTTT dashboard like I am now and what uh, if this and that does is it automates a lot of the processes that uh, you otherwise would have to do manually online so for example in this demonstration I'm going to set up what's called a recipe and I'm going to use two very popular uh, applications and I'm going to help them talk to each other in order to accomplish a task that otherwise I would have to do manually but rather make it automated so what I'm going to do is I'm going to use Instagram and when I make a post to Instagram I'm going to tell if this then that to send me an email at my email address so how do we do that well looking up here in the top right hand corner you have a few different things my recipes create browse channels and then your account settings uh, for the sake of this demonstration, I've already created uh, a recipe. If you wanted to create a, a new recipe, you simply click Create there, and then the first thing you do is you choose If This, Then That, and you click on This. Now this can be any one of these items that are listed here. So it can be a blog post, it can be a shared bookmark on Delicious, an Evernote, Gmail, Instagram. Uh, you can see there's tons of the popular uh, apps that you've already come to know on the web available for you to create a recipe with. So if I clicked on Facebook for example I could choose well, a new status message, a new link post by you, a new upload photo so on and so forth but uh, like I said I'm going to click back there actually I'm going to create this one out of Instagram so I click on Instagram and I say new photo by me that's the action that I want to start so I'm going to create that trigger now if you haven't already done so you'll have to authorize your Instagram account because it needs your Instagram account credentials so if Instagram then that so I click on that and we will pick uh, well, I don't want to pick Gmail I want to pick email right here for any email client then I'm going to choose the option to send me an email so if I post a new photo to Instagram I will have it sent immediately to my in my email address I find that helpful because sometimes I take a photo with Instagram, I apply some filters or whatever, and then maybe I want to email it to a specific friend or I want to email it to myself that I can so I can use it uh, to post in a blog or whatever later. Uh, but anyway, once you're done with that, you just click Create Action, and now your recipe is created. Now you can turn these recipes on or off at any time, and what I'm going to do here is just click Create Recipe to finalize it and then you can view your recipes here I created redundant recipes and now from here you'll see that I can just take uh, literally a photo here I'm just gonna take a photo with my iPhone of my screen I'm gonna apply a little filter to it in Instagram I'm gonna share it on Instagram and then uh, I'll show you here in just a second that it'll pull up in my email uh, in just a moment So it just takes a second for it to go ahead and initialize that email. Okay, so a quick look at my email account shows IFTTT action. I click on that link and you'll see there's going to be the uh, picture of my screen that I shot with Instagram emailed right to my inbox. can be a pretty helpful tool, automate a lot of those processes that like I said otherwise you would have to do manually so it can be a big time saver and it's kind of a neat little thing to play around with so be sure to go to if this then that dot com or I F T T T dot com sign up create an account and of course if you don't already have one go to webstarts dot com create a free website that's my company and also check out more great videos like this